Hi guys, my name's Andy and um, I, I get tinnitus uh, and I've had it for about 10 years and I want to try and do something about it, I want to see if I can stop it and uh, I won't say I've suffered with tinnitus because I don't have uh, the, uh, the real bad noise or pain that people have but I get this ringing, it's pretty much constant uh, it's always there when I'm relaxed predominantly in my right ear but I get it in, in both and um, it's uh, something which has been highlighted recently it's uh, now uh, August uh, 2012 and somebody commented on one of my YouTube videos that there's a lot of uh, top end a lot of high frequency hiss and <laughs> quite honestly I can't hear it so um, I apologise for uh, the poor sound quality of my videos but it, it's simply this high frequency I can't hear because I've got a constant high frequency in my ear and I say I want to try and do something about it um, most of my life I've sort of s solved problems for other people uh, technical problems, uh, mechanical problems um, inventing machines to, to do things and. Um, uh, you know, sometimes people say you can't do this, you can't do that, and that, that's usually a good indicator that I'm going to have a go. So I don't know where this is going to go, but um, uh, what I want to do is I want to make an amplifier to see if I can hear the sound in my ear first of all, so as I can see what's going on. Um, and then I want to start feeding some noises back in to see if I can stop it. This may already have all been done by somebody else, if it is, <laughs> maybe you'll tell me and save me the effort. But what I noticed uh, a couple of weeks ago was I brushed against this bell and uh, uh, that uh, was, was by my ear and it actually stopped the tinnitus. Uh, the ringing of that bell was just like a switch the ringing stopped um, I don't know how long it stopped for but certainly the rest of that evening um, and I've tried it many times since just to ring the bell by my ear and see if I can stop it but there must have been something either about the pitch or the phasing of that bell ringing that actually uh, stopped the tinnitus so say what I'm going to do is I'm going to make a little amplifier, listen to the sound because um, I'm not sure if that sound is in my head or if it's physically in my ear. I'm assuming because the bell stopped it that it is actually physically in my ear. Um, I haven't researched it, which is probably what I ought to do, but I don't do things like that. Um, but I figure if the bell can stop it then it's it's a physical thing so I want to just try and understand it then I should build um, a, a phase lock loop and essentially what I want to do is take the signal or the sound that I hopefully am able to amplify from my ear set up a phase lock loop and then momentarily interrupt the phase lock loop or interrupt the, uh, the amplifier and just put a little shot of sound back into my ear and I intend to experiment with uh, uh, different phase relationships and, and um, different volumes. I have no idea where this is going to go, I don't know how long it will take me to do it because I've got plenty of other things uh, that I should be doing. But in the first place I want to see if I can actually hear um, through an amplifier the sound that's seems to be being generated in my ear. We've got lots of sounds from passing vehicles at the moment. Uh, the farmers are making hay, so we've got some big farm vehicles going past there. Let's uh, say, um, I want to make an amplifier, listen to the uh, ringing in my ear, uh, actually see it on the oscilloscope, understand uh, what I can about it, and then actually play that sound back in antiphase um, and see if I can uh, stop that ringing. The idea being then that I can have a device that I can 
introduce into my ear and um, uh, just give it a little flip and maybe uh, stop that sound. The same. Don't know where this is going to go. <laughs> Might go nowhere. Um, I'm always a better starter than I am finisher. So, uh, say it's 2012 now. I don't know how long it'll take. But um, I'd be interested in your comments, any feedback. If um, you know you've had this thing where some random action has actually stopped the uh, the ringing. I know certainly um, a loud noise can actually bring the ringing on. Um, anyway, uh, I hope you find it interesting. I hope to get some good feedback from you. And uh, thanks for watching, guys. Bye bye.